Hey YouTube, it's Justin the Junkie. How the fuck are you guys doing today? Come to mind why your motherfucking brother is hard to find. You've been walking on the streets and fucking. Uh, today is introducing the March Patreon Tool of the Month. Okay, and part of me going. Uh, th this is part of introducing it. So, uh, the guys wanted to see the Harbor Freight uh, half inch impact uh, in the electric version here. And, uh,. We're going into uh, Harbor Freight. So part of the deal was is that I said I would try to get some footage of me buying it. But I don't really know how that's going to work uh, because I've already been thrown out of this Harbor Freight and there's a lot of goofballs in here. So uh, if I'm not talking and I'll probably have to do some voiceover stuff on this stuff maybe. Uh, Harbor Freight looks jammed right now. Uh, they're having the presidential tent fucking sale. Like, look at all this shit. Look at this. There's the, there's the tent sale and some other people in there. So, we gotta walk in there. Uh, okay, this is fucked up. There's nothing in the tent. There's nothing in the tent. Like, what the fuck? Okay, I'm, I'm confused on what this is, but... Uh, I'm gonna try to go in here and get some filming of uh, me purchasing this motherfucker. Let me get this bitch turned around here. Uh, you know, we are outside the store here. I'll show that to you. Ugh. Harbor Freight. I hate this place. It fucking smells all fucked up, but you can see that we are outside the store. So, I will try to get us uh, some footage of me in Harbor Freight. Ugh. Alrighty, we're outside the Harbor Freight. They didn't have anything in the tent, but what they did have is all this shit out here. So, this is just me walking through it, showing you some of the shit here. They had a big-ass workbench right there. I don't know. This was pretty cool. I've never seen this brand. It was called... Well, fucking Poland or something. I, I don't know what the fuck it was. Uh, there's those Predator motors that, like, the farm guy burns up. They're 94 bucks. Hopefully he bought a whole bunch of them so he can blow those up. Uh, they had the big-ass toolbox on sale, three forty nine. dollars uh, Down here, here was something. It was those cases things. I've never seen that. Apache 3000. You know, Harbor Freight is... You know, they come up with some fucked up marketing terms. That's just my two cents, really. Uh, you know, this is me trying to open it up. This it, It's hard to open it up and hold the camera. I'm fucking fucking everything up. You know, sorry for the fucked up camera work. You know, it, it was really junk. That's what the thumbs down was. Uh, now we got inside. Here's these new uh, Harbor Freight uh, roll cart things. Uh, it was on sale for $149. You know, it had a different style latch system. And actually, these are big improvements over the other ones that they used to have. So they got it in the blue color. The blue color is actually nice. Here's another one. I think it's another new one, or maybe it's the old one. I really don't shop there, so... Maybe you guys in the comment section will let me know. I really don't fucking know. Or do I care? But for 150 bucks, this thing isn't too bad. It definitely felt a lot sturdier than the old ones. Uh, this is that lathe thing. What a piece of shit this goddamn thing was. Uh, I was just playing with it here. Uh, it felt real crusty. Uh, not real good. You know, the build quality was not excellent on that. And I really don't know what you would turn in that type of lathe, to be honest with you. It, it, that thing, for 150 bucks, it had shitty power. This is me looking at a drill press, you know, all rusty and fuck. You know what I'm saying? Uh, here's this thing. I've been looking at these band saws, but not from Harbor Freight. You know, again, here's some more... Uh, drill bits and whatnot, you know, this stuff is just so crusty. 
I really don't like it, if you get what I'm saying. I, I don't fucking enjoy nothing in this place. I did buy a couple things uh, just to try for later. Uh, here's for you guys, Hotties and Harbor Freight. There you go. Got a quick butt shot. And then there was some other stuff coming up. Yeah, here we go. Here's all this new Bauer stuff. So they got all this, like, electric jackhammer type bullshit, you know. You know, I would rather have, like, a Hildy than this, but that's just me. You know, bunch of garbage. 69 bucks. You know, I thought maybe I could use them. Here's this Bauer thing. They made this Bauer one. It's 450 foot-pounds breakaway torque. So this is, like, you know, the... Uh, their in-between line. I don't know if it's the flagship line or in-between line. Here is the Hercules stuff. This stuff just felt pure garbage. Uh, you know, I'm not getting paid to review this garbage, so, you know, I'm not going to be fucking with it. Here's that thing that ABE had uh, that he said was not too bad. Little stubby impact. Uh, it didn't tell me. I didn't look at how much torque it was. Here's what our Patreon tool of the month is. God, my camera work sucks on this. Sorry about that, guys. So this is me picking one up. Yeah, I bought it. Yep. And I feel like I, you know, did what I had to do uh, to ease all the Patreons there. Uh, this thing right here was, I've never seen a die grinder like that. So it was trying to be more comfortable, you know, uh, if you're saying... Uh, this is me looking at these, uh, there were some big floor jacks or air over hydraulic jacks. This is just some more general garbage here at Harbor Freight. There's my, you know, the jacks or the engine crane wasn't too bad. Some shop presses, you know, not really impressed with all that stuff. Just feels kind of chintzy to me. This is me wandering around the store like a complete moron. Uh, looking at the microfiber towels. I was looking for something. This thing I thought was pretty cool. You know, for, what, I think 159 bucks. Look at that. I mean, I don't think you could build one for that. You got an old bubble balancer there. Many of those used. You know, this is what I was wandering around for. I was trying to find these mill, end mill things here. So I was looking at the Drill Master series, and then I found, oh, look at that. They got the Warriors. Uh, they had an open box of one of these. It was missing about phew, fucking more than half of them for 59 bucks, or for 70 bucks, 74 bucks. I got bought the whole thing. So I bought the whole thing. You know, I'm going to review those. And then this is something for the women. Uh, you know, if you need a concrete vibrator, maybe a personal massager, a hundred bucks, ladies. Look at this thing. I mean, it, I mean, it, I mean, the hose is really long. I mean, look at that thing. I bought this fucking thing. Uh, Eric O says it's really good, but, uh, you know, we'll have to try it out. I also, I bought these, okay? Warrior fucking end mills. I have a feeling these things are pieces of shit. Earlier, you saw me look up some that was an open box. Let me tell you, uh, they look pretty crusty, but uh, I'll have a second review on these uh, sometime. I'm going to try them, but we did get the Patreon tool of the month. Uh, this month, we got their Earthquake XT all day, all day. Uh, this thing uh, is supposed to be, we'll find out. Uh, I feel really creepy going in there and I use my bank card uh, now uh, you know the government knows I shop at Harbor Freight and that's uh, you know it is what it is but they did have some okay stuff I mean like they are starting to switch what they're doing and all that type of stuff you know so it's not really too bad but ugh, it's still crusty um, what we'll do is we'll get this home. Uh, we'll take a look at her here when we get home. Uh, but I just wanted to prove part of the thing was doing this tool review and why people picked it is because for some reason, uh, my Patreons love to put me through the punishment of going into Harbor Freight. And those guys do pay to keep the channel supplied with content. So 
you know, I got to do what I got to do. But still going in that place, ugh, it gives me the creeps, you know, because I know the place is full of just Chinese crap. But, uh, you know, these end mills look fucked, but we'll check them out. We'll see if they cut material. Uh, you know, we'll probably try like aluminum and some other shit. But uh, the cordless tool there, when I get home, I'll take a look of it, uh, you know, and all that stuff. I just noticed something on the box I want to show you. It says, delivers the power of air. We're going to find out. I don't think this thing has anything on Big Dick Banana Hammock. Obviously, it's going to beat the snap-on one because it's only 600 foot-pounds. But, you know, uh, when I get home, I'll open this piece of shit up and uh, we'll, uh, you know, take a look at it. I actually, you know, I want one guy to win it because he left a comment, said that if he got it, he's going to the beach in Florida and going to catch it on fire. And, uh... I think that's fucking funny. But anyway, you know, it's not going to be rigged. But uh, if you guys want to get in on this Patreon raffle, remember, uh, it's Sunday now. I'll probably get this video up Monday or Tuesday. And we will go till uh, next Saturday. Before next Saturday, you will have a chance to win this tool uh, on the March Patreon Tool of the Month. Um, if you missed this one, there's always you can sign up and, uh, you know, get into the next one, whatever it might be for April. I have no clue yet. We'll have to see what it is. But uh, I'll, you know, give some first impressions of this thing when we get home. Uh, let's take a look at this fucking thing here. Oh, what the fuck? Time! Okay. Uh, we get the tool hole. Oh, boy, this thing is okay. Uh, it does come with tells you how much battery you got here. Uh, we got I guess full battery. I don't fucking know. Um, I will tell you that this thing is very, very top heavy and it is brush or it's brushed so it's a brushed motor uh it's not brushless uh it only comes with one battery which doesn't be like a good deal uh this charger is chancy as fuck uh you know the blow molded case is not bad uh the clips are nice, you know, it's got that. I had to open it with the Carlisle fucking clippers. Uh, let's take a look at this. Uh, again, more junk. But anyway, uh -huh. this is what we're reviewing this month. We'll see if this thing does 1,200 foot-pounds. Uh, we're going to see what it does taking off some lug nuts, how hot it gets, and all that stuff. And uh, kind of just take a look at her here run her through the paces a little bit but uh to me you know fuck it's it's a fucking tool i guess you know so uh the fuck oh they got a little yeah this thing i don't know i don't know about this harbor freight stuff i know that guys you know love it they say all day you know i'm just uh I'm not that impressed with their quality or stuff like that. I know that Erico says that this thing is pretty good, but, you know, it is what it is. But anyway, uh, like always, guys, check out the Patreon account. Check out uh, Junkie Shop Time on Instagram, online tool vendors. Uh, you know, links in the description for that Amazon stuff. All that stuff helps out the channel. Uh, let's just do... You know, more stuff like this. You know, stuff that viewers want to see. Uh, nobody shot a video like this quite my style. Uh, I'll do some voiceover at Harbor Freight. But, like always, again, till next Saturday when we test this son of a bitch. Uh, you have that to get in the uh, fucking Patreon thing if you want a chance at this. Uh, but, like always, thanks for watching. And I gotta fucking go.